Hello, this is Beth Berry and Talk Cry with WCAT coming with coming to you with uh, new information. Okay, Barry. Well, last Friday's game against Sublet, the JV girls lost, the varsity girls lost, the JV boys lost, and the varsity boys won. Monday's game, middle school basketball versus Southwestern Heights, the A team boys lost 34 to 31. The B team boys lost 34 to 32, and the boys C team won 31 to 26. The girls A team won 36 to 21. The girls B team won 17 to 14, and the girls C team won 31 to 21. And last night's game against Deerfield, the JV boys lost. The JV girls didn't play. The varsity girls won, and the varsity boys won. And make sure you check out the middle school game tomorrow at Lincoln here in Elkhart. So this week is homecoming, and we have that game this Friday. Uh, as you can see, we're all dressed up for Wacky Wednesday today. Um, there will be a pep rally this Friday at 3 o'clock. It's open to the public, so make sure you come out and support the Wildcats at that and at the game. The game will be on our YouTube channel. If you don't know how to get there, all you need to do is go to youtube.com, and then in your search bar type in Elkhart, uh, Elkhart High School, and then it should be the first channel to pop up. And you just click on that, and you can watch any of the videos we've uploaded. Okay, talk right. This Friday, January 12, the elementary school will be having their owner assembly at 3 p.m. Public is invited. And Friday, January 19, USD 280 will have early dismissal at 1.45 p.m. for teacher and service. Okay, um, the ACT deadline is this Friday. Just a reminder, um, behind us we have artwork by Whitney LaRue. This is a pastel piece. And this is by Bethany Thomas, and it was done in Pittsville. Um, Bethany Thomas was awarded an, an honorable mention at the Kansas Scholastic, and so was Jade and Hannah for her artwork that we showed last week, and it was of Mangolias, if you remember that. Um, we'd also like to thank Kristen Fish, Miss Kansas, for coming and giving us a wonderful uh, assembly last Friday, and uh, it was really good for all our students. That's all our information for this week.